Well, hello, good evening to you as we join together here for what will be the last step on the road to qualification for the grandest of all the competitions in European club football. Teams here right on the edge of the elite. Players from both clubs return to work early to be in prime shape for this. This a potentially season-defining moment, despite the fact that we are still only in late summer. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. An air of unease. We all know what's at stake here. Do we not, Jim? Yes, and if you want success on a European front, Peter, you must be able to live with the pressure. This is a means to a, a significant uplift in, in finances that can benefit these players and, and obviously attract better. It has huge potential consequences in a positive sense for all concerned. Got things on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Thiago Silva. He's a player who doesn't seem to have any weaknesses at all, Peter. He's strong, he's quick, he's technically gifted and very comfortable in possession. What I particularly find impressive about him, though, is his consistency and his reliability. He just never seems to, to make a mistake. Opposition strikers could be in for... A hard time of it today. And Zayek! It's off target and by quite a way. Zayek looked very impressive there. Well, at least until he got into a shooting position, something I'm sure he'll want to have a go at again. Hudson Atoy. It's anyone's ball. Yeah, he's fouled him there. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. Enrique. managed to get it all wrong well there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited and they need filling and fast Hudson Atoy. He's looked long this time. And he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. It's Aspiliqueta. Hoists it high. And out to safety. Gets wrestled off the ball. And has put a stop to that. 
hoists it forward. Goalkeeper's ball. The referee's awarded a free kick. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Shoots! They've scored! Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do. Chelsea draw first blood here. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Enrique goes looking. Grenier. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Hudson Adoy takes control of it and he's on the move. Tries to get it forward quickly. Grenier. Oh, some clever movement up front. Yeah, they're playing with a, a false nine and no one's really holding a fixed position up there. How does that work? Well, I think it's an attempt to just confuse this defence with, with constant interchange and, and different movement. Zayek. Rudiger, Pulisic, and it's Marcos Alonso. Up for the header! Oh, just needed a better contact. You have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Chelsea given another corner. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. Pulisic pings it in. Defending of the desperate variety. Up he gets! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Thiago Silva did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Hudson-Otoi. Good challenge, he just stood firm. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. And it's played forward, done very well to intervene. Can take battles to win it back.
Chelsea are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. Forward it goes. Pulisic. Sayek. Hudson Adoy. Hudson Adoy! A real chance and a real let off. Still a cracking effort. Really looked like a man on a mission the way he went through on goal. Hoists it forward. Werner. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. And it's played forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Rudiger goes looking, and the whistle goes for half-time. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Do it back on the first 45 minutes. Well, I think the scoreline offers a fair reflection of the level of endeavour from both teams. I think they lead because they did most of the probing. A little more penetration, I think, should help them get the job done. Chelsea head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Clear away. Grenier. Enrique. Forward it goes. Stad Rene. Disappointing in the end there. They lack urgency. And it's Aspiliqueta. Werner. Got a sight of goal here. And it's hoisted clear. Raspilicueta. He hits it! Whipped in. Hudson Otoy. Grenier. To get it forward quickly. Decent looking ball. Shot it goal! But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Hudson Adoy! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Enrique, Stad Rene to retain the ball, but are seemingly in no rush to break forward. Zonzi drives it forward. Forward it goes. Tries to get it clear. Fires from distance. Well, I suppose it wasn't the worst attempt if you consider how far out he was. Out to the left it goes. And they win it back again.
And it's Crenier. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Just brushed off the ball there. Grenier. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And the counter is on. And, oh, that's too long. Stade René are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Pulisic. Surely a foul free kick. Chelsea looking to pull clear here. Certainly looks appetising, well within shooting range. Say it! Oh, it's come off the upright. Another chance! And yes, it's there! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Well, some fans are already on their way out, so that to me says everything, Peter. He goes long. Stad René with a corner and hardly any time left on the clock. Away from immediate danger. And Sonzi. Werner. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Chelsea have the tie at their mercy. Avoid defeat at home and they are through. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, and a result that was true to form. The big team beating.